The allegations of financial misappropriation levelled against Governor Alex Otip, our group recently has been described as fallacious and inciting. This is the position of speakers on the ages of RBA Youth for Good Governance, which condemned what they described as unsubstantiated allegations against the RBA State Governor, accusing it of funding the court case of Nigerian opposition Labour leader, presidential candidate Peter Obi, New Central's Chinwe Ukele. As more. The group identified as Abia Youth Interest Group had at a press conference in Abuja a few days ago alleged that Governor Alex Oti was using Abia State government funds to push the litigation of the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Mr. P. Tobi, the president of the Abia Youth for Good Governance, Mr. Chinenye Ukebu, frowned at the development. Abia State was looted and plugged into bankruptcy by the previous PDP government. Whence, Governor Oti, a knowledgeable economist and notable financial manager, could not have attempted to use the scarce resources of other state to fund the presidential election litigation. We therefore call on all audience and Nigerians in general to disregard and discountenance the unfounded, unsubstantiated allegation made against our governor, Dr. Alex Oti. The president said criticisms help shape any government, but when such are targeted at creating disaffection, they should be condemned outrightly. This one is an allegation or unfounded allegation that is, is always leveled far from the truth and is capable of sending a very bad signal to the public, to Nigeria, and is capable of bringing and showing a seed of discord between the federal government and the state government. So that is why we are against it that anyone who wants to criticize the government should criticize the government constructively and not trying to blackmail or trying to run down the government of either state. A few weeks into the new administration, the Youth Interest Group alleged that there were no frames of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu in Abia State Government House. Chinwe Ugile reporting for News Central.